Our goal is to make custom treatments the new standard for every patient around the world. At TechFit Digital Surgery, we make people's lives better after traumatic injuries of their bones. Our process has three steps. Number one is acquiring the data. Number two is the co-creation and validation. And number three is the manufacturing. In the data phase, we start with the patient's imaging files, so the CT and the MRI, and we convert it into a 3D model that we can then use for engineering. The co-creation and validation phase starts with the physician. We'll take their needs and turn them into a design and then validate them to make sure they're up to engineering standards. When we were introduced to Anesis Discovery, we were able to introduce simulation upfront into our planning process. This means our digital models will behave anatomically and mechanically like the patient will, allowing us to do very rapid iteration and improve the surgical product and the surgical outcome. Quality control is an important part of our process because the implant design directly impacts the patient's recovery and rehabilitation time. We can quickly model an idea, explore different design scenarios to see if it works, and we can validate leveraging the trusted ANSYS solvers. As a design engineer, when simulation becomes my second nature, it proves how easy to use ANSYS discovery is. The saying goes, practice makes perfect. But without a good feedback loop, you can actually practice the wrong thing and become very good at doing something wrong. That's why we rather say iteration makes perfection. At TechFit Digital Surgery, we help people when they need it the most. We're dealing with cancers, we're dealing with injuries. Fast turnaround times are key. Having ANSYS Discovery in our workflow allows us to validate our products faster, help people get their surgeries faster, and help them recover faster.